Today, Brayden? I don't know. You don't know? Can you say spaghetti sauce? Spaghetti sauce? Spaghetti sauce. So we're finally taking all the tomatoes that we got um, harvested from this year before the plants all died and you're gonna work your magic aren't you honey? Yeah I'm gonna add just a little bit of water to the bottom of that. Yeah, I don't want to add too much water because I don't want because we got to cook it down. But I want it to dethaw and not burn. Yeah. Are you excited about this, Brayden? Mm. And we could use our special seasoning for it, huh? We could use my seasoning that um, that yeah. stuff I got from the tea exchange. Yeah. Yeah. So we're we're just gonna bring you along for the process. Um, we're going to. Um, Get this cooked down and then can it. Yeah, I gotta blend it all up, season it, and uh, blend it up. Cool. Let's get some of your frozen onions too. We'll put that in here too. You want onions, like real onions? I'm gonna puree it. Okay, we can do that. Give it a little bit of flavor. All righty. You, you don't like onions. I know I don't like onions, but I don't mind it as seasoning. Okay. It's gonna get pureed. Are you bored? It's more fried mm. onions and stuff like that. Cooked onions is more of a texture thing for me. Mm. Okay. the sauce chopping up all the tomatoes so taste test time yeah Let me before we add all the spices I'm not gonna add the spices till late tomato -y. It's almost like a tomato soup-like taste, almost. Yeah. So... Yeah, it's got to cook way down. Are there any more chunks left? No. Okay. I will puree it some more later. Mm-hmm. But I want to cook it down more. Okay. No, yeah, let's just cook it down more then. All right, got it all seasoned the way we like it. And we are just filling up the jars here and then we're going to then um, get those heated up and you want to, you said water bath them? Yeah, I think we're going to. Use a little, you want to use a little one? No, hold that one. Yeah. Hold that one. So maybe five, or do you think we? You want me to get in a small jar, or we could put it in a bag and just freeze it—the little bit that's left over. What do you think? Why don't we put it in our thing that we freeze our sauce in? Oh yeah, yeah. This is our any leftover spaghetti sauce from any of our meals we put it into this little container and freeze it and then when it's full um we use that. we reuse it <laughs> it's a great way to save a little bit so easy almost not to go for <laughs> that would not be a good thing no look at the Woo, all right so we could try that we'll have to add some meat to it now none of this has any meat and then here's the Got ourselves five, five, uh, what are it, pipes, pipe jars, uh, or quarts, 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 I'm sorry, quart jars, math and, and measuring is not my thing. <laughs> that's why I do the kitchen work. Yep, that's why you cook, I clean, we're good on that. Yep. 
Okay, here we go. Got that cooking, and then we're filling up the uh, the big uh, canner so we can get these uh, canned and pressured. Turn that water down. Just turn a little bit. Turn this down. It's on medium high. What do you want? Medium low? No, just medium. Medium. Okay. Okay. End result. The cans all nice and sealed. It came out great. And a couple days ago, we actually had a um, the sauce that was left over and it tasted really good so we are very happy with even though it's just a small batch it's still a batch so there you guys go